A search is on hold right now in Cass County after two schools were found there. And now two families are with missing daughters are desperately waiting for answers. We want to go now to KCTV 5's Natalie Davis, who has been speaking <clears throat> with the families of those missing women. Natalie, I mean, they are just hoping for some kind of resolution, right? They are. This is where we spoke with the moms of Cara Kopetsky and Jessica Runyons yesterday after they say police told them two skulls were found in Cass County. And now they're left wondering, is it their daughters? The emotions hit them hard and now they wait for definitive answers. Today we spoke with Jessica's dad, John Runyons. He said he's not doing anything differently until he knows for sure it's his daughter and that news has not come yet from police. Ever since Jessica went missing in September, John has coordinated search efforts every weekend. He's taken what he knows about the investigation and strategized over which areas to scour. He said until he hears something from police, Saturday's search is still on for 10 a.m. and they could use some help. He can't help but admire his strength and his focus. He's not going to give up. I asked him what keeps him going. Jessica, it's my daughter. I'm not going to stop until she's found. I'm just going to keep going on. One or two things going to happen. We're going to have our closure with Jessica, or we're going to keep looking for Jessica. That's bottom line. Police have not provided an exact timeline of when they expect those results to come in. And in the meantime, we are staying in touch with family. Live in Belton, Natalie Davis, KCTV. All right, thank you, Natalie. And you can stay up to date on this developing story on KCTV5.com or on our news app. Just search KCTV5 in the Apple or Google Play stores, and it's free on both devices.